What's up guys, this is the Roseman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of My Empire Total War Let's Play as Louisiana. So to remind you about last time, we have been doing some fighting in, in the European theatre, we have destroyed Great Britain, but now Sweden has declared war on us, and during this intern phase we have been attacked by a Persian force. So let us destroy them in good order, and I fear we will never be able to march on the capital, because by the time we've replenished, uh, they've created another army of chaff to send and destroy us. Um, but we have reinforcements coming up from the rear, so even if this army does get damaged now, then uh, that will not be a big problem. I might actually divert one of them northward to go off the map to come back in and attack Sweden. Okay, let's set up a good old defensive battle. Yeah, not not a terrible position. So the thing to bear in mind about artillery in this game is that it's actually uh, pretty flexible. You can put them in some bad positions and they'll lob shots up and over terrain to get them where you want them to be. There we go. Guard to core on each flank. Just the one. General in the middle. You men may burn powder. Desert warriors. And the musketeers are going down. These gunners aim at the camel mercenaries. These guns aim at... These camel nomads. Potentially halt fire until you've reloaded with... Oh, that's a, that's a bad angle. That's a really bad angle. Let's see if they bug through the hill. Nope, they've all fired over. But they have routed, so let's get this go firing round shot onto the Desert Camel Mercenaries. These guys can fire off Axis at the Camel. Actually, aim at those Mercenaries. Some more camel gunners. Extra hits. So they have come back. So they're coming in again. <laughs> Friendly fire there. Hit the, you hit that levy even though they're slightly out of range. You hit that levy. There we go. Then let's get these howitzers to open up on supporting targets. So who's that back there? Just a unit of light horse. I can hear them charging. I 
They can charge at my gun line if they wish. You guys fight you guys fight the Zemendari horseman even that's not quite what I wanted you to do. My gunners have died despite me trying to fall them back. You guys charge into that combat, this line push up. Bring the guard to core into action and start to chase down some of these troops. Looks like an Israeli unit has come back. And it looks like we've started to get some annoying little sound bugs coming in. Enemy general's been killed. Come on, cut through them. Very well, charge on down. You men line up. You guys can continue to attack. Any of positions here, the camels are done. Nomads have charged us. You guys, canister shot. Those musketeers. These men line up. These gunners, canister shot. That desert warrior. My general into the mix. Come on, you men, get into position. Now you go for the desert warriors, you go for those Felline musketeers. Turns out heavy cavalry is what you want to fight camels. Let's try not to get the general bogged down in this combat. Everyone else is falling. Okay, you can hit them, you hit them, you guys go after the desert warriors and their speed up time. I know, we do have enemy reinforcements, don't we? In which case, let us form line. Let's allow my cavalry to continue chasing down this army. So get both my remaining gun teams fire on the 12 pounders to the rear, although it looks like you are so you are well and truly bugged. Let's fire round shots. You trot over. You're still doing good work. My general is going to carry on chasing down 
some of the levy. These guys are going to stay where they are, just in case any of these guys decide to come back. Looks like these bowmen, though. Yeah, yeah, I've got sound sound bugs creeping in. So charge the bowmen. If they're going to run into our lines, just charge them. They won't stand against our marines, that's for darn sure. Got another a unit of Israeli coming up. Okay, got some friendly fire kicking in. Form your line. You open up on the camel gunners. I might get one of these guys back to round shot or quick climb. Start to try and hit those camel gunners, even though they're slightly out of range. Those Israeli have almost immediately broken. Okay, they've routed. <laughs> Hit the second order with everything I got. I doubt they'll stick around for too long. Yeah, my general will come and knock out that auto of Desert Warriors as well. Let's get my Curve de Bois up on the hill. Curve this flank inwards a bit. I mean, it is a pity about the sound, but... Well, you guys observed it. It just happened. So our lines are engaging. Oh, they charged us. Very well. Let us push up the flank. So my hope is I can break the 17th. I'm aware of the first pushing up on the right, but I want to break the 17th. We fire on the flank. These guys are going to open up on all combats, including the 100th. The 100th are broken. Push up the line. There we go, that has the 100th are broken. The 5th are able to open up into the combat, because it's a bit dangerous, but my guard de corps already routing anyway. Plus there's lots of camels over here. And they're not going to be able to chase down my gunners. I mean, the AI is deciding to set up here in a position that will cause them a lot of grief. Charge their Israeli with mine. I think that's well, that will soon that will be everyone dealt with. Get you guys in against the Israeli. They've broken the hundredth, came back. I 
as have the artillery. Ah, oh, good. I was going to say, you know, you, you can see the enemy running, and they're going, no, don't run into the lines I want to set up to try and kill you. Let's just stop the artillery, because right now it's just damaging more of my men than theirs. Actually, you're better off just to set up there shooting. This Israeli unit isn't going to stick around for too long. They do have bayonets, that's something at least, although you'd hope they would this late in the game. Those units can't actually engage over here, and finally, this battle is over. Whew. So I really hate fighting battles in the rain, it makes visibility so much crummier. But there we go, they lost a huge chunk of troops. Back you go. First thing we need to do is go back and knock out these raiders in India. That's the very first thing we need to do. Then go, then go backwards into into uh, not backwards, sideways into Europe. Fine, break my pleasure gardens. I don't care. So this unit, yeah, it's just their general. Victory! Yes, my lord. And you go up and hit this chap here. Not shall defeat us. By the left, march. Replenish and get down towards Theodore. You got this build a church school. Well, they've already got one actually. Got a craft workshop. This army march south down to here. Just keep the conversion going. Then I'll start to move up men. You're still marching up, as are you. You're a bit depleted, but you're making sure that these Persians don't go backwards. New men replenish. So yeah, you are getting reinforcements. I might actually send you. It would take a while. But go north. Actually, I might send two of them. Two men north. Let's open up a open up a new front against the Swedish. That will surprise them check our construction keep our keep our economy expanding yes yeah, see as soon as I've left the city they go aha we can move in we are triumphant you men are punished once more. Ready for you guys are going to get hit by Louis Tomanipis. You are going to march south and deal with him. Let's get some units of troops out so I can then push this army from Amsterdam out to try and hit somewhere else. Don't want to do any building yet either. Spain have sent a sloop to be annoying. But they're not raiding, so I'm not bothered. Let's repair these buildings. Christiana does have a seminary. Let's repair the steam dry dock. Build a craft workshop. The new Theodore Louis Theodore Garnier. Garnier. March south against Finland. 
Although we're going to auto resolve this fragment that's just sat here in the woods. Despite the losses it incurred. Keep marching. They're going to come after Riga. That's for darn sure. And there's nothing we can do about it. Coming after Germany. There's not a lot we can do about it. And they're coming after pr coming after Prague. Let's see you guys. No, not militia. You guys churn out line. Your Majesty. And yeah, at this point I really do need to start being a bit more offensive in this part of the world. Very well. So I was planning to merge two armies together, but instead... One, two, three, four. Oh, and that's way too much infantry. I was going to uh, build two separate... Ooh, infantry view. Boo. Okay, not yet. Actually, yes. Let's not, let's not recruit the guards in one infantry and then get some infantry view. Can't recruit that fusilier unit either. I probably need to get rid of one unit of infantry there. So in London... Unable to recruit any artillery that's not a six pound a horse artillery. Okay, what about Edinburgh? Well, same with Edinburgh. How bizarre. Uh, so let's get some. Okay, you know, Chasseur à Cheval, two Cursier. I'm already getting garrison guards. Two engineers. And two line. Let's start to fill this out for another army to sail. I expect we will lose this force here. Because they are completely isolated. And then we do have... It's not, not a great navy. It's a bunch of fifth rates. So I'm going to sail Charles Louis Bonaparte over. It's going to be an auto because it's a massive fleet of heavies versus a massive fleet of not so heavies. We are victorious. Let's bring in their third rate. Awaiting further order. Yes. Take ready. Back to the Windward Islands. New men replenish. We do have a lot of troops down here. We've got this force here at Caracas, and we've got this force here waiting in Santo Domingo. Workers are on strike in the Black Hills. Not anymore. They're 100% Catholic, in which case, then let's send you to the Northwest Territories. Agent detected. That was their little spy. Um, okay, so first of all, let's get you guys in here to punt the Jebek out to my sloops. The new men march up. Orders going. Anything more? Make ready. You guys hit Saeed Talat. That's going to be an auto. Triumphant. March! Majesty. This backup force here sit on the bridge. Let's see if we can draw these Ottomans into a bridge battle. That'd be pretty cool. You men. March for Damascus. Well, I'd like you to have done that through crossing the desert rather than following the highway, but okay. Yes, my lord. Sir. By the left. March. At least now... 
Baghdad does have fortifications. You're in a good spot to try and deal with them. Or, to be honest, you men are the garrison. So you're going to march out and deal with Farouk bin Yakub. First of all, you need to start all the way back here. Start to the east. Clear out the Middle East for the battle you want to do. And then go over to France. Ready and awaiting. So you men, let's go clear out this small pocket of Persian troops. Because we do want Theodore up on the front line. We want him storming through the countryside. So, let's set up our artillery. I mean, this is a fantastic position, really. So let's set a line of infantry to push up against the position we know about. Let's have a smaller section go around to flank also be aware of the fact we might have they might be behind us Theodore come out with them my howitzer I didn't deploy just on limber and fire quick climb No, 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 no. Hey, Addy, I Addy. Heavy armoured cavalry, armoured lancers. No, 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 no. Quick climbing howitzer, focus on the 24 pounders. Everyone else, open up on this heavy cavalry. So you fired your volley to get into square. You fired your volley to get into square. They're going to do a real number on our guys. Make sure the square stays intact. There we go. They've been repelled. Plenty of men coming in from the rear. Let's get our artillery to attack more conventional targets. This artillery to start to bombard the reinforcements coming in. There we go. There we 
Okay, I get my native troops around to help. Get my cavalry around the right to crash into the bowmen. Let's try and get more muskets around to fight this mass of troops. Although a big sweeping left flank up to about here would be pretty cool. Go get him, cavalry. Mercenaries, camel gunners. Get you guys into square. There you go, my Crassiers want some of that. Me likey mercenaries. Their troops don't like people who fight them, though. So this big sweeping flank manoeuvre didn't really work. Some of my troops, some of my cavalry on the left. God, one, one click with artillery was enough, and that was that. They were done. Yeah, you can chase down the camel mercenaries, you're quick enough. Actually, come up here, actually, and fight the massive block of men. Get my colonial light up forward. That would have been, it would have been a lovely hit. This is a bit of a slaughter, isn't it? You go after that unit. These guys aren't efficiently la aren't efficient efficiently laid out either, but whatever. Just block off that point. Get my gunners to hit the unit of bowmen here. So you can see that they, uh, the AI is now going to decide to focus on the cavalry behind the lines rather than actually trying to win. Switch my howitzer to round shot. All my artillery engage no one. Get my cavalry out of that combat, that's for darn sure. So get them up, get this cavalry up here to try helping this combat. There's a lot more scope to do damage. Slash, cut, thrust, job is done. Yeah, there's not really a lot they can do. Not really a lot they can do. So many men, my cavalry can't reliably kill them all either.
damn right I want to continue. Speed up time. No, they didn't get to the gunners in time. Theodore. Continue his tally of almighty kills. Decisive victory. That was really quite decisive. <laughs> Pity he was way back behind the lines. Forward, march. But nevertheless, keep on pushing Forward, on. March. They need to be dealt with. Yeah, is he didn't keep recruiting militia. You might actually stay back, just in case these guys split up. Then what we want to do... Armand Villeneuve, Men. march up to the north, ready ready swing south and hit Faro Naruzi. But, looking at the timer, I believe it's time to end the episode. So, thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the destruction of yet another Persian army. Cheers everyone.